Welcome back to Red Wilson Field for more of the Anglers Extra pregame show. It's time for Catch of the Day. I'm Drew Carter now joined by Chatham pitcher Dan Hammer. Dan, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Doing great, thank you. You come in as a freshman of the Cape League after one season at Pittsburgh. What's that been like so far? Oh, it's been a great experience to be here as a freshman. So just playing against this competition, it's really helped me so far. What do you think the difference is between ACC batters and Cape League batters? Oh, I mean, there's no holes in the lineup. I mean, one through nine, it's everybody's best, best hitter. So it's just really fun to, to compete against that. You've been working with another freshman, Shea Langliers, as the batter for the past couple starts. What's it like working with him? I mean, it's great. I mean, he's awarded a Cape All-Star, so it's pretty cool to be working with him. And just an experienced catcher, a young one, but a really, really good catcher to have behind the dish. And last night at Veterans Field, last couple starts were a bit tough for you. Last night was pretty good, a couple innings with only one run allowed. What was your mindset coming into that ball game? I mean, my past uh, starts where I didn't do as well, I was kind of keeping the ball up a little bit. so. My goal last night was to keep the ball down, which I, I did for the most part, but didn't throw as much strikes as I wanted to, but I mean, it's a step in the right direction for sure. Can you give us an idea of what you're throwing out there? Uh, I'm still working with my two seam a lot, so that, that's been a big pitch for me this summer, and uh, working my change up and slider as well. That two seam fastball is actually the first thing Shea Langlier's brought up when I was talking to him about you. How long did it take you to develop that pitch? I mean, I've always kind of had it, uh, especially going into college. I knew it was a pitch that I would need to to get better at, and this summer was an opportunity to work on it, so it's been it's been really good so far. Now, as a freshman at Pittsburgh, you broke into the weekend rotation your first year. How'd you do that? Well, I mean, that was my goal coming in, so a spot opened up, and I, I filled the role, so I mean, hopefully I can be uh, one of the top guys moving forward. You came to Pittsburgh from the Philadelphia area. How'd you end up at Pitt? Um, it was um, one of my first uh, visits, so I really loved it there. The facilities, great coaches, and so I just jumped on board. Uh, regular season nearing a close here this summer. What have been some of your favorite experiences this year in Chatham? Uh, I mean, just hanging out with the, the guys on the team. Made, made some really good friends this summer. Just enjoying playing every day. So it's, it's been really cool. And one guy you probably throw to a lot is the bullpen catcher, Jason Turner. Recently told me he thinks he's the best catcher on this team. What are your thoughts on that? Uh, I agree 100%. <laughs> he's, he's my roommate, actually, so he's one of my, one of my good friends. Yeah. Yeah, he's a great, great kid. Yeah. He seems like a big reason why the mood is usually pretty light on this team. Have you ever had it seem where the guys mesh so quickly? Oh, no, I mean, I didn't really think it was going to be like this. I thought it was kind of, wasn't going to be as uh, team oriented, but I mean, it's been great so far. Mm -hmm. yeah. All right, Dan, thank you very much. Right, thank you. Dan Hammer, our catch of the day today, the Anglers in YD to take on the Red Sox in an interdivision matchup. Now back to Max Hurst for more of the Anglers Extra pregame show.